Okay, this is drug release from a matrix, problem 1325. The first part, we're simply defining or formulating the problem. As always, we are trying to see what we need to solve for. Okay, so what are we solving for? We have diffusion in a slab geometry where the stuff is diffusing from these surfaces and we need to find an expression for this release uh, from the two surfaces this one and the other side at short times and then if I know the amount of release if I know the amount of release at uh, short times then can we back out diffusivity from it likewise if I can I find an expression for release from surfaces at long times and can I estimate diffusivity if the amount of release at long times is given so those are the four things that we need to find um, the schematic in this case, it, the domain where we are doing the computation is the inside of a slab. And um, so it is the inside of, the, of this slab, um, not, not the outside, not, not, not here, um, not here, okay. Um, but these two directions are impermeable so that the slab we have diffusion only from one side so release from this side and the opposite face and the surface concentration cs is zero on this and opposite face um, initial concentration ci in the slab is given the assumptions, remember we can only do 1D problems uh, and, and so we have to assume the no release of drug like I showed in the other two directions. We cannot do the problem other direction um, with what we have learned in class. Uh, there are, uh, uh, you know, we can combine the solutions that we have in the class in different ways but we have not talked about it there's also numerical solutions that i prefer other assumptions diffusivity does not change as the slab loses drug so that the diffusivity itself is constant over time and then dimensions do the, the dimensions do not change as the slab loses drug the slab doesn't shrink or swell. 